everyone. So in this video, we're going to be looking inside the stomach of three carnivorous plants. We're going to be looking inside of a Nepenthes, a Sarcenia, and a Venus flytrap. So I have gloves on because this one is the only reason why I have the gloves, because I don't want to get nasty insect juices all over me. So let's start with the Venus flytrap. Let's open it and see what it looks like inside. So it doesn't look like much. I mean, it's just a dead fly inside of it. And the camera's out of focus. Right, there we go. So there's not much to see here. It's just a dead fly that's kind of, like, wet, I guess. But anyway, that's all for that plant. Um, now let's look inside of the Sarcinia pitcher plant. This is going to be kind of gross, I think. Because the pitcher plants are the most efficient way of catching bugs in the carnivorous plant world. So let's open it. Don't know what I'm going to find in here. It kind of stinks. It really, like, there's this smell. It just does not smell good. Huh. Let's go all the way down. So there's definitely some stuff in here, but there is not a lot of stuff in here. Wow, that's surprising. This um, pitcher was absolutely empty. There's nothing in it. Well, I guess the only thing that leaves us left is this plant. Now, this is probably going to be gross. So, if anybody is squeamish, um, I suggest that you look away now, because this is going to be gross. Alright, let's see what's inside. No, oh, ooh, that, that looks real gross. But anyway, here's a cross-section, I guess, now. There's still some bugs in there. But anyway, there's a cross-section for you guys of a pitcher plant. If I can just get it in focus. Oh, there we go. So here's a cross-section of the pitcher plant. There's the lid, there's the peristome, and then it just falls here into the stomach. So, thank you for watching. Um, if you like this video, I suggest that you watch a couple of my other videos and see how you like the channel. So, um, see you guys next week, and goodbye.